Welcome back to At Your Leisure, everybody. We're in Katie's Kitchen, one of my favorite places to be. And we are gonna be cooking up today with Katie on your delicious Yardley premium beef. We're gonna be doing some just kind of grandma's type meatloaf. Oh. I mean, so, some old authentic meatloaf, old school. We're going old school today. Love it. Okay, well, I know it's a crowd pleaser, so let's get going. Let's get cooking. All right, what do we do first? We start off with the, uh, we want to saute our veggies. So we just, let's melt some butter, add in the onions. Okay. And then one thing I do with my meatloaf, mm -hmm. I like to grate. You know how you grate cheese? Yes. I grate my carrots. Look at that. So the thing is, you just want to soften them. Okay. Which actually, they're pretty much there. Uh huh. So let's turn that off, and we're gonna let them cool down for a minute. All right. Okay. So we we want to put our two pounds of our Yardley premium beef, butter it. beef, <laughs> into Love the it. bowl. Okay. Then we got the veggies coming in. So we got the veggies coming in. Okay. Then after the veggies, four eggs. Okay. We do a quarter cup of cream. Okay. A few dashes of Worcestershire. Okay. Worcestershire. And then we got to get some salt and pepper in this mm -hmm. baby. And once we got this in, we take our previously grinded Ritz crackers. And, I, and, and here's where it gets very messy. I'm thankful Rhea has got my back. Because <laughs> you literally, you have to get in with your hands. I got your back. It's kind of like when your kids had Play-Doh. <laughs> I like how you're making it kind of flat and not like a real high. Like no, no, I, I like don't a... like it super high, but I like it into a loaf. Yeah, that's beautiful. It'll cook, you want it to cook as evenly as possible. Yeah. Okay, so I have to wash my hands. Give me a second, and we'll come back and put the toppings on. So for the topping on our meatloaf, two cups of ketchup. I like to use like dry mustard. Mmm, that's a good idea. About one to two tablespoons. Mm -hmm. Got to have a little bit of my organic cane sugar you or could. brown sugar. You can use brown sugar, that's just fine. Okay, so this, once we get this mixed, you want to put, not all of it, you want to put a, a small portion on top of your meatloaf. We're going to put it into the oven. We're going to, 350, we're going to bake this for 45 minutes. We're going to open the oven, take it out, and then put a lot more of the sauce on top. Wow. And then bake it for another 25. All right. So, Katie, now we've had like 45 minutes to cook. You're taking this out, and we're going to put yes. some more of that delicious topping on top. Yes, we are. So, let's oh, slather yes, it on. <laughs> we're going to slather some, a bunch more. I can't wait to dig into this. So, we got another 25 minutes to cook yes, it again? Yes, okay. so we're going to put it back in for another 25 minutes. All right. So, we, we got the meatloaf off the, the pan. Yes, we put it onto a platter. Yeah. It looks prettier. Sprinkle it with a little parsley. All right, let's dive in, sister. Oh, it's look at that. That is beautiful meatloaf. Beautiful. Look at that. I can't wait to take a bite out of it. Mm. It's hot. Cheers. Cheers. Mm. Oh. <laughs> it's so moist. It's fantastic. That is like the best meatloaf you have ever eaten in your life. Yeah, and you're not bragging. Oh, it, no, I'm not bragging. You know what? It really is the best meatloaf. It's it, fantastic. It, it is. If you, I, I gotta have another bite. <laughs> absolutely. If you want this recipe, go to AYLTV.com and it'll be right there. And if you're interested in cooking with Yardley Premium Beef, go right here and check it out. And you can yes. order it up and get it in your house and make this delicious. It makes a difference. It really does. It's so yummy. Don't go away. We'll be right back with more At Your Leisure. 